you have to go back to a single moment in the pre-dawn chill of a New Mexico desert. The date is July 16, 1945. The time is 5.29 a.m. Inside the control bunker, the air is thick with sweat and the smell of ozone. A low hum of electronics is the only sound. For the scientists and soldiers gathered there, the world has shrunk to the hands of a clock and a single switch. They are about to pull a trigger on a weapon that draws its power from the heart of a star. Humanity is holding its breath. And in that bunker, one of the men responsible for the final countdown, for making sure the trigger works, is a British physicist named Ernest Titterton. As a senior member of the timing group at Los Alamos, Titterton wasn't just a witness to the Trinity test. He was one of its chief architects, a specialist from the British mission entrusted with the complex mechanics of nuclear detonation.